We could buy some black boots and take some fingernail polish and like. Ooh, I like these. Am I the only person in shock that this stuff exists? Well. What's up guys, welcome to Clever Style. It's Taylor Swift week. Yeah. As you guys know, it's no secret that here on Clever, we're just obsessed with Taylor Swift. obsessed with her, so much so that in today's video, we are actually going to be recreating four of our favorite Taylor Swift looks, two streetwear outfits and two red carpet outfits. And listen, we know that Taylor Swift has a stylist. She has someone helping put herself together. Yes. So Aaron and I are kind of gonna go out there and help you guys find out how you can put Taylor's looks together on a budget. But also, you should subscribe because we're doing a major Taylor Swift giveaway in this video, which we haven't really done before or at least in a long time on this channel. Yeah. So what you have to do is wait to the end of the video. We're gonna reveal what that giveaway is and you also have to subscribe. So if you haven't, click that button. All right, we're about to go shopping, but before we do, I feel like we need a strategy and a plan. Yes, we need to look at all these outfits and really figure out what we need to buy because there's nothing worse than like walking into a store and not knowing what you're getting. Yeah. I get a lot of anxiety when that happens. Yeah. Or walking into a mall and not knowing exactly where you're going and what you're getting. Ugh, I'm already anxious. Okay, let's look at our first outfit. Taylor in this floral dress, long sleeve floral dress. So we're gonna need a long sleeve summer dress. Uh huh. It looks like it has pockets, but it yeah. also is a button up. I feel like this look, this entire look is very boho, but Taylor's wearing these knee high boots, so mm -hmm. she's kind of dressing it up a little. Is this brown or nude, Erin? What do you it's think? It's kind of like camel. It's camel. Yeah. I think that might actually be really hard to find at the mall because it's not yeah. winter. I know, but if we do find it, it might be on sale because it's not winter. Oh my God, I hope so. And then Taylor's also wearing these rounded shades, which perfect for summer. Yeah. So boho. It's like a very hippie style look. And that bag I really want. Yes, the bag is a brown bag and it has a chain. silver chain. Ew. So that might be hard. So yeah, this is going to be my first look. So I think we should hit the stores and go try and find it. Let's go shop. Come on. All right guys, we're in Target, which is an extremely dangerous place, yeah. especially if you don't have a lot of money in your wallet. Okay, so for my paparazzi outfit, I feel like Target's a great place to find floral things and sunglasses. Literally, they're on the same rack. Oh my God, look at all this floral. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna be real with you. All what? of these floral, dr floral dresses floral? are like sleeveless. They don't have the long sleeve look that Taylor's has. No, I need a sleeve. I need a sleeve. Yeah. I don't like my arms, sorry, I just don't. Ooh, I like these. Wait, very Elton John. Cool. Except the coloring is a little rose. But I like these, Erin. I know, but I almost feel like Forever 21's gonna have Mom, one. you never let me get anything I want. Okay, well, let, if you're nice, we'll get a cake pop on the way out. <laughs> All right, we made it to H&M to the bag section. And but also, isn't this hat cute, Erin? Yeah, it's not a Taylor Swift hat, though. And I think we found a dupe that looks really close to Naz's. Purse. I don't know guys, what do you think? But it's not orange. I don't know, I think it's pretty close. Even the little close. black little piping detail on it. Look what I found. What about this? That's super cute. Let's Is see that? if it has a chain. No chain. It doesn't have chain. But you know what? These orange purses tell me that orange purses are a thing in the world and that maybe we should keep looking. Let's keep looking. All right, guys. Erin actually found all these floral dresses at H&M. So H&M has a lot of long sleeve floral dresses, which is really hard to find. And there are a lot of cool patterns, but I think this pattern is gonna be the closest one that we can find that matches Taylor's. I love it. I think we're gonna grab it. We found this dress! Yeah! yeah! All about shoes right now. We made it to Nordstrom Rack. There's literally every shoe that you can ever imagine in this store. Erin, look what I just found. Literally almost the exact pair that Taylor's wearing. I cannot believe I found these in the middle of summer. Wait, are they my size? Nine and a half, I'm an eight. But like whatever, I'll just wear them. We made it out alive. We have been shopping for a very long time. Um, we didn't find everything we needed, and I think we need to go back to the office and do some online shopping, because let's be real, it's 2019. We're gonna find the rest of the stuff online, so let's go. Let's do it. All right, Naz, what did we not get? Okay, so for my paparazzi look, I'm still looking for an orange purse with hopefully a chain link strap. And then- Leather? So, yeah. And then I also need sunglasses for this one. Mm. Oh, the Chanel one, how much is it? 
probably about five dollars too much just five dollars too much okay that mm. one looks good 178 dollars is kind of expensive too much the that's kate spade oh i like this one. Oh my god this bag's perfect this bag is exactly what we need yes i love it add to cart Okay. okay, let's find the glasses now. Rounded with gold rim. With gold rim. These are These perfect. Will work. These will work. You guys, get it. I cannot wait for this stuff to come in and try it on and see what the final look looks like. I can't breathe at all because I'm so excited. <laughs> I can't wait for you guys to see Naz's new outfit. Naz, how do I look? You look so cute. Do I look like Taylor Swift walking down the street going to get maybe a matcha latte? Honestly, I think you kind of look better. Really? Yeah. You know what's funny is I'm not used to seeing you in some like you would girly, never right? wear anything like this. This is very girly for me. It's really girly, but I like it. Okay guys, so for this whole entire Taylor Swift look, the boots, the dress, the sunnies, and the bag, it was a total of $155. Which kind of sounds like a lot, like I'm not gonna lie. Yeah. But suede boots are not cheap. Like I'm sure that put this whole outfit like over the edge. Right. But if you buy a good pair, suede boots, they last you forever. And you know, it's a good investment piece, for as your mother would say. Yeah. And for comparison, Taylor's look that looks just slightly different than this was over $5,000. Yeah, so 155, not too shabby. But I do have to say, we're kind of missing something that's like atmosphere. You know what I mean? Uh oh, like you I mean like, like a pretty brownstone behind me that costs a bajillion dollars. A yeah, <laughs> we need to like teleport you or transport you or time travel you. What is the word? Teleport. Teleport you to New York City to walk down the stoop looking like a celeb. Oh, it looks so good. I really feel like we nailed that. It's as close as you could come to designer. All right, Erin, we gotta see you in your outfit now. I know, I'm so ready. Okay, this look is going to be pretty hard slash easy. It's kind of like having an identity crisis <laughs> because it's very casual, but it's a very specific casual, this if you know like what I'm saying. This is like sexy cash. So Taylor's wearing this kind of like oversized button down men's inspired slash four year old at church inspired, <laughs> like picture day inspired outfit. It's off the shoulder. It's really, it looks like a designer shirt, but these shorts, I feel like you're gonna find anywhere. But one thing about these shorts that might be challenging is that they have all these like buttons up the crotch area, Ooh, which I, I like. Those. But these shoes are kind of, they look like footballs. <laughs> okay, it has contrast color stitching on it, which I am so, so right. here for. These boots are everything, Erin. Well, they look really cool. It looks like we could buy some black boots and take some fingernail polish and like. <laughs> Okay, so that's three pieces so far, but you have yeah. one more, right? Yeah, it's this bag, and it's not really sure. It's another chain purse. It has a little graphic design. It has a pattern on it. Exactly. <laughs> we have a lot of work to do. I'm excited to see you in this outfit. Ugh. You're gonna look bomb in it. Thanks. We're gonna find it. Okay. I mean, these have the ridges on them. You Where could cut it, Erin. That's true. But the frame looks exactly the same. But we I feel like we could also find shorts that look exactly. I don't know. What okay. do you think? I think we should keep looking. Okay. Okay, so we found this shoe, which is not exactly like Taylor's, but this is a recreation. We're clearly not gonna nail Taylor's. It's Taylor beautiful. Look. We have to get it. It's okay. So pretty. But I have one bad note. What? There's only one. Where's the other one? We have to find the other shoe. Okay. We must. I cannot believe that you just found the you other guys shoe. I have no idea. We have been looking for the shoe for a very long time, and one of the sales associates found it. It was like, great. There's a lady who was standing behind us who was like, Yeah, I was looking for the other one too. She got there before we did, but she put it back. And so she was standing there when the lady it. found it, and she was like, Do you have another one? So we have to get out of here before this lady. Yeah, we have to leave. Okay, guys, we're looking for some of the drop down earrings. Which these are pretty close. I like those. Those are really pretty. Oh yeah, they are pretty close. I secretly just want them myself. <laughs> I think you can pull it off, right? Yes. Yeah, so we can't really tell exactly what the earrings look like, but after seeing these up close, this pair is really close. Can I get it? Yeah. Can I get it? Yeah, it's exactly the same. Okay, okay good. <laughs> I'm getting it. We're getting it. Okay, so this is my paparazzi Taylor Swift look. And I need a lot, we didn't grab a lot at the mall for this, so I need a white button down prop. 
right? Because this is kind of cropped. Long sleeve. Ooh, Ooh, that one's cool. That one's close. It's not cropped though. But what about this one? Oh my one? god. This one's so close. You're gonna look so cool. I'm so excited for this. Okay, Love add it. to cart. Okay, Next. What else do I need to get? Jeans. Jean short. So here's the thing. We went to Forever, mm -hmm. and the lady at Forever told us that Forever has shorts just like this, but they didn't have them in stock. So let's go check them out and so see if I can find them. There's so many jean shorts in the world. Ugh. Those look designer. I just feel like you're never gonna find the exact match of the fraying and the buttons and the color. Okay, uh, so. These are close. Wait, those are great. They're a little lighter in color, but I will say on me, because I'm so pale, they'll look really dark. So we have the shirt, the jeans. The purse. We need to find a purse. Okay, so black with chain and pattern. We found a lot of silver chain straps that are available on Amazon. I Who didn't knew? even think to like buy straps for purses I already have. That's such a good idea. In case it breaks, you never know. Yeah. You know, when you're buying from Forever 21, you never know. All right, we've ordered everything. All we have to do is wait now. The transformation will begin shortly. <laughs> In two days, Amazon Prime, you know. All right, guys, Erin is dressed, and I can't wait for you to see it because she looks so bomb. Here she is. Hi, everybody. I'm Taylor Swift. <laughs> The crowd goes wild. Erin, you look so good in this outfit, and I feel like this is an outfit that you wouldn't normally put on, but we nailed it. So this outfit in total cost around $132, which is not terrible, but I think the boots is what kind of put it over the edge. And these boots, they were made for walking. We had a fight to get those boots, you guys. We sure did. So, but this shirt came from Amazon, which I kind of like this off the shoulder. I like the whole outfit. That shirt is the MVP of this outfit, like second to the, or maybe first to the shoes because no one wears a crop top like Taylor does, like off the shoulder. And I think that's such a fun way to style it. Also for comparison, Taylor's version of this look costs over $2,000. Crazy. So you Not could look like it. this for 132. So I was kind of jealous that you had to go to New York earlier and I didn't get to go. So it's my turn to step out side of my New York City apartment off of a stoop. I'm so excited. I feel like our streetwear looks went really well. So let's find out how our red carpet looks too. Let's dress it up. This is a very iconic Taylor look. Iconic Taylor look. And can I just say, Erin, I am so happy Taylor's in a color now because I did love Reputation Taylor, but I love colorful Taylor so much more, right? Yeah. Okay, so we're actually gonna try and recreate this look and I'm gonna be wearing it, so I'm super excited for it. So these are, Erin and I don't really know what it's called. I think they're like oversized fish scale sequins. Yep. Is what I would call them, which I love because I don't like little sequins. I really hate him actually. But this is like really pretty. But the thing is, I think it's gonna be really difficult to replicate. Yeah. Because it's multicolor and it's all one look. Like the top, I think it's a romper. Yeah. So we're either gonna have to find a romper just like this or a top and a bottom that matches. So Taylor accessorized this outfit with silver butterfly heels. And since we're not shopping in the 90s, I think that might be kind of hard to find, but you never know. You I, never know. I think you can find it. Let's go see if we can find some silver butterfly heels. Let's go. Oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. Erin just found the literal sequence that we were looking for you guys. Yeah, it's hard to see me through all of this sparkle and shine. <laughs> um, but you know what? It looks exactly like the picture. The pad, like the fabric looks exactly the same, but this is a sleeve, a strap, like, not strapless, but a spaghetti strap. Spaghetti strap, yeah. So we need something that has a real sleeve on it. Yeah, we need long sleeve, but I can't believe we found like this exact sequence in a store. That's I know, crazy. Forever 21 coming in clutch. I saw this on Revolve. This outfit? Mm -hmm. Let's sure. see if they have it. Let's see if they have one that's cheaper. Okay. Short sequin romper. romper. Sequin romper. Oh, oh, there it is. That's close. But the thing is, that's just like the one we saw at Forever 21. You're right. So the issue is we keep finding this. Oh, there it is. This is it. Oh, that's nice. Mm -hmm. 238, mm -hmm. can we afford that? No. no. You know what I'm thinking though, Erin? Fashion Nova. Oh, Fashion you would Nova, know that. Every time there's a moment where a Kardashian steps out or Taylor steps out and it's a moment, they rip it off and recreate it. So I bet you Fashion Nova has something similar to this. Okay, let's try it. They do have a lot of sequin options. They oh my gosh! 
Yeah, this but is, that one's spaghetti strap. But like, it's really they close. have it, yeah. It's really close. They have to have something else with this. Okay. Oh my god, yes! This Eric! is really close. And it's on sale. That's amazing. If I wear the top and the skirt, it'll look exactly like it. So close. Now, here's the hard part. What? The shoes. Silver heel Pump. with butterfly detailing. I feel like it's gonna have a bunch of children. Wait, shoes. that looks cool. That's really close. Wait. Wait, how in the hell? Oh, look at these two. Wait, what? How did, what? I've, am I the only person in shock that this stuff exists? Well, no, because I'm on Amazon like 24 seven and okay. I find the weirdest stuff. So yeah. I'm not super surprised, but the fact that it looks so close is surprising. Damn, I can't wait for this outfit. I'm super excited for that. Do you want to trade shoes? Not, yeah, for the black boots? Yeah. Okay. All right, guys, Naz is dressed, she's ready, and you may not be able to see her yet, but if you listen really closely, you can hear. Sounds like Taylor Swift. There she is! Ta-da! Ta <laughs> you look like some sort of, like, really pretty bird from a Disney movie. I feel like I look like Big Bird's stepsister or something. Yes! Or like, fabulous Sesame Street. Here I am. This is such a hard look to recreate. It's a really cute look. I have to say, I am obsessed with these shoes. Same. I don't know if you guys can do a little zoomy zoom, but these shoes are really cool. They are such a statement piece. This is a two piece, just so you guys know. So what I love is I would actually wear this skirt out with it's like cute. a plain solid top. Just because this is a lot for me, but also like be extra, be Taylor. Ooh, all right. Can you do that? I can do that. Okay, so Taylor's romper alone was $184, and we made this entire outfit for $184, which includes these shoes, fabulous butterfly shoes, this skirt, the matching top, all of these rings and these earrings for $184. I have to say though, $184 for Taylor Swift's romper is like, kind of mildly affordable considering the other outfits we've tried on that are streetwear that cost thousands of dollars. Doesn't really make sense in my head. <laughs> but you did get more for $184 going this route, but I think we should link to both options in the description. That's very smart, Erin. We'll link to both so you can look exactly like Taylor or our reinterpretation of Taylor at the links below. This look is going to be the hardest look of all the looks to find. It is so unique. It is very ice skater chic. I love the color. I think it's beautiful. It looks great, but it also probably costs more than my life is worth. I know this designer very well. I think it's two women and it is worth a bajillion dollars and they custom made this for Taylor. So yeah, it's gonna be hard mm. to find. The good thing is, is because it's so hard and it's only one piece, at least that's the only thing I really have to find. I mean, there are some cute like nude-ish color pumps that might be like, you know, might take 20 minutes of my time. <laughs> also, I forgot the jewelry, the ring, the butterfly ring, and also the earrings. Those the earrings. cuffed earrings were so everything on that carpet that day. I've never worn a cuffed earring. You're gonna look awesome in it. Can't wait. After looking at the options, Aaron, what's going on over here? What is this? What we, is this? We know why Taylor got hers custom made because this is a travesty. I don't think this is something you're gonna find on the internet, and I know the internet is a big deep hole, but this doesn't exist. This is custom made, so I'm happy to settle for like, just like inspired by lavender lace doily ballerina. I, should we do ice skater? Tanya Harding um, conductor orchestra outfit slash pirate. Here is a dress from Lulu's that is purple, it's lace. It's clearly not this dress, but I feel like if Taylor was a normal girl and shopped at malls like normal people, that this would be what she would try to wear to red carpet. Okay, okay. are you gonna go with this dress? I'm going to, yep. Now we need to find the statement ear cuff, which is everything. Oh, these are pretty close. <gasps> those are so cool. <gasps> those are cool too. I love those as well. But I think you need one like all the way wrapped around, you know, just so it looks kind of like Taylor. Wait, Yay! those are perfect. These. Yes. Oh my God. Doing it. Yes. God, Amazon is everything. All right, guys, it's our final Taylor outfit. And I know this goes without saying, literally everything looks good on Erin. Everything. Oh. But she looks 
Unreal. Thanks, that's so nice of you to say. You look so beautiful. Thank you, thank you Taylor for inspiring this look. Um, I feel pretty pretty. And this comes from Lulu's, it's really comfortable. It has some of that like lace detailing, it's still very pastel, it's still very new Taylor. And I really feel like you could wear this anywhere. But also my eyes just go to this earring that you have on, oh, which yes. is the coolest statement piece ever. So on that day, she wore a custom earring piece, um, but I think we got pretty close, Erin. Yeah, and this is from Amazon. I'm not gonna lie, it's a little tricky to wear and it hurts a little bit. Oh, but beauty does. is pain, you know? That's like, that's how you know you're celebrities when you like show up and you're in pain, but you also are beautiful. Yeah, like who cares if your ear turns green? You look like Taylor Swift. Exactly. Have the rings. Including Taylor's angel wing ring. Erin, this looks just like the one Maybe she's wearing. Maybe she got it from Amazon. Maybe she did. She has gotten some things from like Target and like, you know, Bloomingdale's before, so maybe this is from Amazon. And these shoes, they're Sam Edelman, which is the same brand of my last Taylor shoes that I wore. But I just, I feel like Taylor Swift. I feel feminine and girly and ready for a new Taylor album in this outfit. I think you nailed it, Erin, and I would even go as far to say that this dress looks like it was tailored to your body. Oh, so the shoes, the dress, the jewelry, the ear cuff, in total was $145. I mean, you can't ask for anything better. I mean, the original yeah. was over $3,000. We've recreated almost every Taylor look for just a little over 100, or I would say a little under $200. Each. Each, and this was so fun. Yeah, I wanna do this again for like every celebrity look, mostly because my wardrobe needs a makeover. All right, guys, this was our fourth and final outfit. Let us know in the comment section below which one was your favorite. And guess what? We're gonna link all of this stuff down there below too. And if you've made it this far, you probably are very interested in the giveaway that we were talking about. I'm very excited to tell you about it. One of you is gonna get $200 of Taylor Swift merch. Huge. But here's what you gotta do. Are you listening? Write this down. You have to subscribe to this channel Obviously, there's a button right there, it's free. And you also have to comment in the comments and let us know what Taylor Swift song is your favorite song. I know it's really hard to choose, but you have to pick one. Mine's mean, and I have a feeling that this is gonna spark a lot of intellectual debate down there in the comment section. A lot of intellectual debate. <laughs> Be nice to each other, guys. All right, you guys, that is it for this video. I'm excited for Taylor Swift week to continue, and we will see you back here tomorrow in another video. Bye-bye. Hey, Lil, you know what you don't wanna shake it off? What? Taylor Swift week. It's Taylor Swift week right that's now. That's true, that's true. There's more videos if you click over there. And subscribe. Because then you'll miss no videos. You won't shake it off. Subscribe. Right, you'll shake it in. It's not working. <laughs> <laughs>